Good morning, humans. How are you today? It is Monday morning. It's a little cloudy, a little bit rainy, but here we go. Another week. We got this. So I've been thinking a lot because I have a lot of time to think. And while I've been thinking, I've been doing a lot of observing. I've been trying to spend as much time as I can outside. And when I'm out there, I'm just looking around like, what can I talk to you about? What is inspiring me? What can I really bring my attention to? So today's theme is all about observation. It is the theme of your yoga practice. And I'm just going to give you one video to practice this week. It's a little bit long. It's like 34 minutes. Um, but that's okay. You don't have to do the whole thing. Give it a shot. Um, I've previewed it. It's it's not too hard. Nothing crazy. Um, so I think you can really do it. You just got to dig in 34 minutes. It's, you know, a half an hour of your day. Um, your goal, I guess, would be to build up by Friday to be able to sustain the whole 34 minutes. Or if you're just doing that practice, let your body learn the routine and observe how you feel each day. Do you feel a little bit different? Do you feel stronger? Just observe inside how you're feeling. And when you're done, see what you can observe in the space around you. So let me show you a couple of observations that I can make right here in my kitchen. So here is a new plant that I got. You see that? It's an ivy plant, which means it's going to grow and sprawl. There we go. And you can see there's a window here. And do you guys see what I see? What's this little guy doing? They are reaching for, that's right, sunlight. They need that. Um, another thing I observed is when Chris and I moved to Maynard, which was like two months ago now, we had this bamboo in Somerville and it was always doing so good. We got it, it was like 12 inches high. It's like the length of a ruler. And well, let me show you what it looks like now. Can you see that? Nice and green. See how all the leaves are green? See this yellow though? When we moved here and we started using the water out here in Maynard, the leaves all started turning yellow. And we kept watching it and making observations and thinking like, why would this happen? This thing has been living great for five years. Why all of a sudden would it be changing? So we did some research. We looked up online uh, what would cause a bamboo's leaves to go yellow. And guess what? It's the water. The water in Maynard is really different from the water in Somerville. It has a lot more minerals in it, and it was causing the bamboo to turn yellow. So we had to actually buy distilled water from the grocery store. It comes in a big gallon jug, and um, distilled water just means they take like all the minerals and stuff out of it. So now, after a couple weeks, it is really doing great. So now we can observe that by changing one thing, oops, let's see, I'm gonna show you the water, see the roots there, isn't that cool? By changing one thing, we can get the plant to grow healthy again, and that goes the same for you. If you can observe one thing about how you're feeling or what you're thinking about, and you feel like it's not really giving you what you need, it's not serving you, it's not making you feel like a better you, do some research. What can you do to change it to feel better? Does it mean doing yoga? Does it mean watching funny YouTube videos? Does it mean playing a game with a family member or a sibling? Whatever it takes, you guys. Observe how you're feeling this week. It's okay if it doesn't feel great. It's okay if you notice that you're feeling really excited and you don't know what to do with that energy. But how do you find a way to observe notice, internalize it, reflect a little bit, and then change what you need to in order to keep moving forward. That's what this is all about this week. You have a new science assignment that will be posted later today, also about observations. 
came across a very new, exciting observation on my walk this morning. That's it, you guys. Have a great Monday. Observe the world around you. Observe how you're feeling. Do the yoga. Work up to it the full 34 minutes by the end of the week. I think we're going to have our first live yoga class on Thursday sometime mid-morning, so stay tuned for that. I'm observing that I'm already a little nervous about doing that, <laughs> but also excited. And uh, I hope you have a great day. We got this. It's Monday. Here we go. Mm-hmm. <laughs>